This is our room. Quick tour. There's a wardrobe here. There's a lovely little desk. I don't know why there's a sleeper couch. And this is the bed. We are in the room called Mauritius. We'll pretend that we are actually spending the next couple nights in Mauritius. The bathroom is really cool though. This shower is huge. Can you come stand in the shower? Look at that. That is a huge shower. Yeah. I feel like five people could fit in there. Okay. And it's got a toilet and a jetted tub, which is cool. No, no. On that boat cruise right you guys saw the sunset was beautiful some lady was like celebrating her birthday and everything it was fun and then on our way home we were like oh let's find a place to just pick up dinner it'll be like it'll be like something quick I was wishing for pizza so we found this random place we literally Google mapped a place to eat on our way home and we found fire cafe and gin restaurant whatever. Cafe something about fire and gin right so I'm like cool we'll stop there have a drink while we get like a takeaway pizza or something and it'll be cool. We stumbled upon it and it turns out they were just starting their quiz night. So we were sitting there watching them as they started like the first round of questions and stuff and I think by the third question the guy that was emceeing was like okay you guys seem interested just join us just take part in this because he could see that like Keegan knew all the answers of course. Because if you guys don't know this, Keegan is like the master of 30 seconds, apparently. I still have never played 30 seconds. Well, no, I have played 30 seconds against you and I lost. Hey, in Cape yeah. Town? Yeah, loser. Oh, shush. Anyway, no, come tell the people what happened. Try upset. You know, but just come say. No. Come say. Yeah. They must see your shame. <laughs> so we literally... <laughs> We literally stood there. It's not that bad. We stood there. Well, we sat there, sorry, and we're taking part and guys We got seven out of ten for the first two rounds. There was three rounds total And I think we were tied in first place with the other three tables, right? And I think there was five tables competing and this was their last quiz night of the year So it was like a big deal and when we joined it was like an accident, but then eventually we were like we want to just Annihilate them Exactly. <laughs> we want to annihilate them. We want to beat them. And then we get to the final one. And for some reason, those last few questions were just the worst. Like, we sucked at that last round. And yeah, so we ended up coming third out of five for our first. We losers. <laughs> we're not. We got third. But um, apparently, the people that came first have been coming first since they started the quiz night the entire year. So, you know, it is what it is. But it was fun. No, it was fun, but, but did you have fun? By losing. 
Did you enjoy yourself? Regardless of the score, did you enjoy yourself? Yeah, yeah, I was fine. Okay. Good night, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Did you find a dead joke? No. <laughs> Why did the blind guy fall down the well? I don't know. Because he could not see that well. Look at my stack of flapjacks. Whipped cream. And bacon and eggs. And an omelette tushy. Everybody loves John Dory's. We ordered some sushi. We decided we're gonna try some oysters. Because why not? Oh, you're gonna try the big one? Because I don't want the big one. Do I have to have the big one? Anyway. That looks disgusting though. Doesn't that look so gross? So you just, just uh... That, oh, cheers. Oh, jeez. Just gulp it, right? Salad. I swallowed the whole thing. The texture is disgusting. Did you chew it? How was it? Okay. The flavor isn't bad, it's the texture for me. Yeah. We did it. We did it. <laughs> First oyster. Oh, okay, so he wants to show you his nails. Look, we got our manicures. Show them your nails. They're shiny. Yeah, you can see. Go like this. Go like this. Yeah. Keegan's got shiny nails. He's so proud. We got our manicures today. Hello, guys. Look at Keegan is still in his uh, uh, Mauritius Island style outfit. Clearly, he's. You had a tough time leaving. Huh? You had a tough time leaving. Why? No, I'm teasing you because of your outfit. Yeah. Oh, just didn't even land. Anyway, um, yesterday we had breakfast and then... Oh, this lady. Yesterday we had breakfast and then we had our massage, like full, what was it called? Jamaica Me Crazy Spa Treatment which was like a four hour pamper session. It was a facial, manicure, pedicure, full body massage and everything. It was really, it was pretty good. Um, but like my nails were painted with regular nail polish and not like acrylic or gel or whatever. So I need to sort that out still. Then we went out and we decided to have sushi at John Dory's and we decided to try oysters, which neither of us had ever had before. So it was an interesting experience, I've got to say. And then we came back and had the rest of our food, like when we were back in our room. And later in the evening, we decided, you know what, let's go for an evening swim. And when we got to the pool, there were these two couples there, like one very much older couple and one younger couple, kind of our age. And when we got there, they were talking about like such random things. And I, I, you know, it's always so awkward when you walk into conversations and people are talking about religion or politics specifically. And these guys were somehow talking about both at once. This lady, the old lady was like, yeah, we truly believe that Nelson Mandela was, was sent to us as South Africans to be like our Moses or something. I don't know, it was just so random. Like Keegan and I were like, okay, let's just find a quiet corner. <laughs> and they ended up leaving and we ended up getting into conversation with the younger couple who had been in their pool probably since our spa treatment had started at about 12 o'clock and they had been drinking up a storm so it was a really entertaining conversation to have i've got to say we checked out this morning came back to Joburg nice and early 
Keegan is just taking our helper home. That's because she's also Keegan's brother and his wife's helper. So we all kind of just came together and gave her a little bit of a hamper, which hopefully she enjoys. So it's a bit too much stuff for her to be taking a taxi in. So Keegan's just driving her home now. And yeah, we're just kind of relaxing, taking it easy now. I think I'm gonna spend the rest of the day editing this vlog, get it ready to go up on Monday. And then I need to do kind of like a pack with me. But before I go, we've got to open the advent calendar. Here we go. We have made it to day three today, so it's also something small. I don't know what this could possibly be. Something small. Oh, it's mascara! Yes! It's Bobby Brown. Holy! This is exciting. Okay, look at that. I got some Bobby Brown, and it is Smoky Eye Mascara. I love this. It's so small, but... Ooh, that's a nice mascara brush. Let's see. Let's see. I'm not wearing any makeup. I'm sure you can tell. <laughs> but let's see. Oh, wow. This is so exciting. I am very happy with this. I'm happy with the Bobbi Brown mascara. I don't know why I keep putting things back in the box. I think I want to keep everything back in its original box because I know I'm flying up to Sudan with this advent calendar. So I'll like take the things that I've already opened out of their boxes when I get there. But for now, I just want to keep it in its original box and put it back. I don't know what, like also somebody tell me why I just put mascara on one eye and didn't finish the other and I'm already like, okay, I'm done for today. I look normal. This is a very flattering angle for you guys to be looking at me, but the mirror is over there. I don't feel like standing up. That is some nice mascara and I've only put like one coat and look how much longer my eyelashes look insane but that's gonna be the vlog for today thank you all for watching this vlog i really appreciate you spending the last few minutes with me coming to hearties with keegan and i i hope that you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys all tomorrow for wait no yes tomorrow i'll see you all tomorrow for vlogmas day four Christmas time.